We ended the last school year with so many uncertainties, unknowns that sustained through the summer and settled into the fall. Amidst all of the fears and all of the what ifs, people were generally worried of what this coming year would look like. How could we take those first few fragile steps forward? What could we do to meet the needs of our students? How could we provide a place of peace for our parents and for our peers? But most importantly, what could we do to help our community and our kids cope? Ultimately, we decided as a school that we were gonna choose hope, to find a firm foothold to lift us up as we stepped into these new ways of living, new ways of learning, these new routines and the procedures that accompanied them. We were determined to delineate away from the darkness and towards the light. We were set on keeping the consistency of our hallways and our classrooms intact, not only for the benefit of the children that inhabit them, but for the teachers whose families have also been affected. We knew opening up would help people focus less and less on what feels fraught and more and more on what feels familiar. And while finding your place during a pandemic isn't easy, it's the tough times that show us why it's the little things that matter most. Having faith, building bridges, and learning to be flexible while still meeting the needs of every single person. We cannot cure the world of sorrows, but we can choose to live in joy to give our students a small semblance of sureness, to not have them learn from a distance, but to learn with those that they hold dear, to give our new and our returning parents that patchwork of persistency and planning, to wrap up their worries and make their prayers for safety an actual possibility. The circumstances surrounding this past year have redefined and reinforced our mission as a school several times over. Your kids will be safe with us. Your kids will arrive every day in affirmation. Your kids will be cloaked in kindness and grace. Your kids will be a beacon for peace. A harvest can only happen when the roots of what we planted are met with care, sown in stability, soaked in sunshine, bathed in fresh air and freedom. What we reap is a reflection of what we were willing to reach for. And this year, we reached for the sky. And every single person involved has shown up, stood steadfast as we sailed into this unknown season. We're all very eager to get back to something concrete. And this year, we were happy to give that stillness to our families. Consistency. Consistency is a key that unlocks plenty. It's what enables us to give. It's what enables us to grow. It empowers us to get through with empathy and emotion. Community. Community is a home that harbors hope. It's a reason to rise and move each day. It's a force that doesn't focus on faults, but rather feats, both accomplished and awaiting. Childhood. Childhood is a spark newly ignited. We get to bear witness to its love and warmth we get to support its splendor and its flame. Today, today we choose joy because we're lucky enough to have a choice to make. <laughs>